Welcome to this demonstration of Mira, ARC's market intelligence and rapid analysis solution. Whether you're a supplier of technology or an end user, Mira will let you make strategic decisions with confidence. Mira is a cloud-based environment hosted and managed by ARC. It's a tool that you can use when you need it. A tool so straightforward, training is practically unnecessary. Mira answers your toughest questions and offers guidance to your decision making. Questions like, how many companies are in a market? How big are they? What do company profiles look like? And what are their histories? Mira holds those answers of particular interest to your sales teams. And more, who owns the market share and what are the percentages? How does that change year over year? Mira delivers that data to improve your marketing strategies. And what are competitive offerings like? How are products segmented in this market? How do competitors make their revenue? Is it hardware, software, services? What are competitive product strategies? And what are their channel strategies? Mira has this valuable information for your product managers. What are region sizes? What regions should I invest in? What industries purchase these products and what are industry sizes? How is all this changing over time? Are you focusing where the money is? These Mira answers guide strategic regional and global sales decisions. And if you're an end user looking to make a product purchase, the information in Mira will let you know the most appropriate supplier in your market and will educate you to the trends in the industry. So far we've been talking about Mira Worldwide, a solution that delivers global data with the granularity to four regions, North America, EMEA, consisting of Europe, Middle East and Africa, and the regions of Latin America and Asia. But maybe regional data isn't detailed enough. You may want research at the country level. Your questions are likely to be, how large are the markets in the various countries around the world? What is a country's industrial breakdown? How are these markets changing with time? ARC has this information in a product called Mira Country. We're currently delivering data on 54 of the most significant countries, and ARC will give you their market breakdowns by domain and by industry. Mira Country also delivers forecasts on market growth. Years of research is now available at the click of a button no other solution matches Mira's ability to deliver actionable data. If you're a client, access is simple. Log into the ARC website with your name and password. Once you're logged in, you'll find under My ARC a Mira link. Clicking on Mira will bring you to the Mira page. From here, Click on Go to your Mira environment now, and that will take you to our hosted solution. Mira is a cloud solution hosted by ARC. We keep the research and technology up to date for you. Mira is an Excel solution delivering the latest Microsoft Power Pivot analytics. We've set up all the macros and graphics to instantly display the results of your analysis. The work that we've done means there's virtually no learning curve you're immediately in the driver's seat. This demonstration includes three workbooks. Selecting File, Open, shows you these workbooks. We've created a fictitious company called Agile Enterprises. And this company has access to three workbooks, Mira Worldwide, Mira Country, and there's a Scratch workbook for any intermediate work you'd like to perform. I already have these workbooks open so we can cancel and let's call up the first one. A launch pad that allows you to go to either ARC market outlook studies or ARC country analysis. This is Mira worldwide, this is Mira country. And we give you the option in this workbook to create new scratch workbooks or open existing scratch workbooks. Let's take a look at the Mira worldwide workbook. At the bottom of this window, you can see a range of Excel tabs. Along the side, you can see a group of navigation buttons. 
These navigation buttons correspond to tabs in the bottom of the workbook. You have the ability to move from one tab to the next just by clicking on them, or you can use the navigation buttons to move to particular tabs. That's all the navigation you need to learn within the Mira environment. As you can see, the buttons and the tabs are color coded. They're broken up into four different areas. We have competitive analysis, business planning, market visibility, and then there are some support and overview buttons. Clicking on the support tab brings us to a view of the studies included with this Mira environment. We have control systems, enterprise applications, field devices, a total of six study areas included. And these study areas include finished data, represented by the green dots, as well as estimated information, represented by the orange triangles. And we have a history of information ranging from 2006 up to 2011. Let's take a closer look at Mira and investigate the competitive analysis area, specifically market share charts. Clicking on that allows us to select from a variety of studies. We'll select control systems in this particular demo. We can take 2010 year information and then we can analyze further by sales channel, revenue category. Let's take a look at the world regions. Perhaps we're interested in Asia as a region. Who are the market share leaders within this area? Or we can select Europe, Middle East, and Africa, Latin America, North America. We can go back, pick a different year, look at how these market shares change over time. What we're doing at the top of the page is selecting with what's called power pivot slicers. And they allow us to select the information that we're interested in. Right now I'm looking at 2010 base data for North America. We can remove the filters on our slicers and take a look at all information. Look at revenue categories, hardware revenues for the different players, service revenues, software revenues. Remove the slicer again. We can select sales channels. How are products sold? Sold through direct, sold through independent reps and distributors, products sold over the internet. Clearly the ability to select data, clicking through the various slicers, allows you to view information in a very powerful way. In addition, Mira provides the ability to analyze subcategories. Select that here and have the ability to look at something like control systems, revenue categories, hardware revenues, and then can drill into specific revenues to do with controllers, to do with I.O., to do with large systems or medium systems. Or by doing multi-selects, by holding the control key down, we can select controllers and I.O. Or add networking hardware. So you can see any combination of, of selections in Mira will automatically aggregate the results for you. A common question might be, how do my competitors change over time? How do market shares trend? Mira has an option for that as well. You can select a variety of companies for trending, select the study of interest, select the years of review, and even pick application areas. Worldwide region, for instance. Focus on EMEA only. See how this, the different competitors stack up. Select Asia, select North America, remove the filter, look at all of their revenues combined. Again, Mira provides that dynamic analysis. Now let's use Mira from a business planning perspective. We have trend charts, which allow you to view information about industries. Right now we're looking at various industry breakdowns, cement and glass, electric power, food and beverage, I want to look at customer types. We happen to be looking at the control system study. How many control systems are sold to end users versus original equipment manufacturers versus system integration? What parts of the world are buying the most product? We see primary market research data and we see forecast information out to 2016. 
If numbers are your thing, then take a look at our actuals tables, market visibility information. This is where all the previous reports are provided to you in more of a tabular format, allowing you to copy and paste them. So far, we've been exploring the Mira Worldwide Workbook. Take a look at the Mira Country Workbook. The Mira Country Workbook is all about understanding how industries vary by region and industries vary in the various countries. We provide that as a business planning overview and then we provide the data and the marketing visibility overview. As before, the support page shows you the studies that are included in this version of Mira Country. Let's take a close look at region by industry. Here you can see we select a particular study that could be field devices, could be control systems. We provide current information and forecast information for various years. You can select to look at a particular region, how the various industries stack up, select multiple region to look at comparisons between one or another, or select all of them. It becomes very exciting when you start looking at industry breakdowns on a country by country basis. So here again we select a particular study of interest, the years that we'd like to compare, whether it's one year or whether it's all years. Look at a particular region, look at particular countries. If you're interested to understand the markets within Belgium, click on Belgium. Select Australia compare Belgium to Australia, add Brazil into the mix, and you can see how the various industries stack up across these particular countries. Remove the filters and you start stacking up industries across the globe. And again, the market visibility takes all of this information and delivers it to you in a tabular format so you can easily copy and paste it to your own workbook for further analysis. As you can see, Mira is breaking new ground in delivering research in a form that's easy to analyze. ARC offers several products. Mira Worldwide is a workbook for all four regions and will deliver data for the study areas that you select. Mira Country is available in four regional offerings. It delivers visibility into the countries within those regions, their industry breakdowns, and their growth for the study areas that you select. The next step is to contact an ARC client manager and arrange a test drive of your own.